Hey guys, what's up? I the Tron here from Clash of Clans Manual. Here with my next war recap video uh, in th Three Star Union, and uh, taking a look at uh, basically our clan. We are twenty five, four and three, so going pretty strong. Um, had another loss, which it happens. Uh, we face tough clans. Our top guys have trouble. Um, our lower guys have trouble with that. So. Had a loss against the Iran clan. They were level 5, pretty solid. Uh, but recently got up to level 4 and had a few wins. We're going to take a look a little ways back at the one against Thug Life. And um, they struggled with our top 4 guys, which is pretty typical. Also, uh, number 7 on KFS Jr. And then, you know, we should have had this base 3 star. Almost, you know me, almost got it. But everything else besides the number 1 was 3 star. And that was very, very close to a three-star. So nice job to everyone at Three Star Union for this uh, war. And I get a lot of requests to look at some very low-level uh, gameplay, and we will. Uh, we're going to start with kind of mid-level with Inferno Mage uh, taking on number five. So like I say, at Town Hall 7, the Lightning Spell is going to be your best bet to take out uh, one air defense uh, for your dragons because... The heal and rage just isn't that good of an investment. Because when you think about it, uh, three lightning spells and basically half of the air coverage on the base is gone. So definitely a good investment. Uh, goes ahead and lures out the CC. I kind of have mixed feelings about Allure. I, I think, because um, looking at what he has in there, the skeletons from the witch can't target his dragons. The balloon can't target his dragons. Um, only those like three or four archers that were in there can do anything to his dragons. So, I guess he didn't know that, but my only uh, warning is, especially when you see troops like that, Valk uh, Valkyries, um, Balloons, Witches, stuff that can't really target dragons, uh, don't spend too much time on them, because a lure can cost you it. Uh, you can see there's builder, a Builder Hut in the corner over there, <clears throat> so don't run out of time because you took too long to lure. Uh, you go ahead and drop a drag and just take those out. Uh, your dragon might lo lose a little bit of hit points, but get it done quickly, because on most of these attacks, it's very easy to 3-star at Town Hall 7 if you use your dragons right, and you can see Inferno Mage, uh, Expert, uh, attack right here. It's very textbook, but the only real concern is if you runs out of time, because when you whenever you lure, uh, that's going to be a 30 up to 40 second investment. Um, the raid has to go relatively quickly, uh, to get the three star at Town Hall Seven, the bases aren't that big, but I still feel like, <clears throat> especially if you see troops coming out of the CC that can't do much to your dragons, uh, go ahead and just either ignore them, drop a dragon, don't waste too much time using uh, archers and barbarians to bunch them up, or using wizards to try to just you know one shot them. Uh, go ahead and get that stuff going, and uh, get your dragons out. Alrighty, so we'll fast forward. It's pretty much over. I think he did maybe drop a troop on that builder's hut, so good job there. On those dragon attacks, you know, bring some archers if you can. Uh, you know, maybe you might have to drop a dragon, bring some balloons and some wizards or something, but make sure those builder's huts are accounted for because it takes your dragon and your king so long to get to them, uh, it can cost you an attack. So be aware of those builder's huts in the corner. Now we're going to take a look at some of that low-level gameplay you guys are asking for. Um, Ashley is cool, kind of a new member, T taking a look at this attack, and I like the use of the balloons here, uh, it goes ahead and lures out uh, the CC, has a balloon, some minions and stuff in it, uh, gonna take that down to the bottom here, uh, and on these type bases, you know, there's s such little buildings that you can afford to lure out and, you know, spend a lot of time with that, but once you get to Town Hall 7, time is an issue, especially with those cornered builder's huts. Uh, so anyway, solid job in the lure, uh, you know, spreading out the archers so the balloon can't target them all at once. So takes out the CC troops real quick, and then doesn't have a whole lot left, can't really get to that air defense. Uh, that's the only threat to balloons at this level is that one air defense, but has 24 level 3 balloons, and that level 1 air defense is not going to be able to do anything uh, just surrounding this base. And you can see it can, even at level 1, uh, it's you know, two-shotting her balloons, but just so many of them, takes it out, I don't even think she uses her clan castle, uh, might have had some level 6 balloons in there, 
but doesn't need it doesn't even need the heal spells so uh if you have those balloons get them upgraded because at very low level they are effective especially cuz people put their air defenses in bad spots you can maybe bring a clan castle full of hogs and let the hogs take out uh, at level 5 they could probably take out an air defense pretty easily and then your balloons can do the rest so nice job uh, to actually getting that 3 star and then last one you know me too uh, taking out their bottom guy and you can see I think balloons are pretty solid at this level uh, drops a barbarian throwing out uh, another balloon some minions this kind of stuff they had in their CC which you see at this level and it's somewhat effective but as long as you just remember on the balloon spread out your archers around it uh, you can see here a little bit tricky because doesn't bring that many archers had there been all balloons in the CC he could have been in pretty big trouble but got to remember that that balloon can't target his balloons so even if he doesn't take it down which I don't think he does it doesn't matter because his balloons can get the job done so uh, I think he had some level not sure what level the ones from the CC were but I guess wasn't able to get level 6 balloons so anyway we'll fast forward because at this level this guy didn't even have an air defense so only the archer towers and the wizard tower can target those balloons and if you have enough of them you can take out the base and uh, got pretty lucky that the CC balloon uh, wasn't able to take it out, but it wasn't a problem. So just um, had he been doing a hog attack or something, or a giant attack, I guess, at this level, uh, make sure you have enough archers to take care of the balloons or any air troops inside the CC. Because remember that your barbarians, your wizard, or your barbarians, that kind of stuff can't take care of it. So bring enough archers, but got the job done. Nice job, too. Uh, you know me, too. So that's the war, guys. Um, once again, another win after this for us. So going pretty strong here and hopefully have another good war that I can show you. But that's it for right now. Hope you guys enjoyed some of the low-level uh, gameplay that I showed this recap. And I'll see you guys later. Bye, Sacktron out.